What is going on YouTube? I'm Valentino with Next Gen Speed. Got my 17 SS right here. It's pretty much been all stock for about a year and a half, about two years almost. Dirty as hell, but she's pretty much been stocked for the past year. Besides like cosmetic stuff, like the splitter rims and stuff like that. Splitter on the back. I actually got a new x back exhaust from Borla, which is a Borla S type exhaust. About to get this put on the car and see how it sounds. I'm pretty damn excited because and I've honestly wanted this for a long ass time, but couldn't really do it up until now. And my car doesn't have the MPP dual mode exhaust, which is the performance exhaust from a Chevy that comes with the new Camaros. And it does sound pretty nice for what it is, but for me, it's kind of too raspy. It just doesn't have that like deep tone that V8s have, and that's pretty much what I want. And with the Borla S type, it will get that tone, and we'll get that raspiness, and it'll be a perfect combination. And honestly, it'll be the perfect setup for what I need. my work right now about to get it put on a lift right here which is perfect all we got to do is cut it off right here right here take off these bolts and it's pretty much easy to drop it and put the new one on no welder nothing it's pretty much some bolts it's pretty easy little head and then we got the exhaust right there Make sure you guys have the stock exhaust sounds. I'm sorry for this compressor that's going off. Alright, so we got the diffuser off to make it a little bit more easier. As you can see, you get to the bolts better and stuff like that. The first thing we're gonna do is take off these bolts, take off this little adapter piece, let it hang, and take off these valves to put on, because you need these or you need a check engine light. So I'm gonna keep those on. And then we're just gonna cut it. Pretty much straightforward, not too not too hard, but it should be pretty easy. Alright, there it goes nothing. Pretty simple. Yeah, it'll go easy. Screw it up. Whoop, there it is. All right, nice. In five minutes, it's off. And the new exhaust is on. The big old four inch tips look badass. Got the Borla embedded into it. Looking fucking killer. But besides that, let's get some revs going, get some pulls, and see how she sounds.
But now that we're back in the car, the car does sound a lot better. It was a little bit louder. Do you step on it? It is a lot louder. It's a lot more deeper. Oh, it is loud. And before it kind of had that little silent sound, like once you hit on it, it'll be loud. Then once you let off, it'll kind of cut off, which is just that perfect mix. It's just a perfect setup for what I was looking for. Because the stock MPP dual exhaust does sound good, it does sound pretty damn nice, and does pop a lot, but to me it's kind of too raspy. And even though I do love the rasp, I want that deep V8 growl that I've been looking for, and this is just the perfect setup for it. And I was looking into the Borla attack setup, but it was kind of like crazy loud to me, and kind of was too more raspy than deep. And I'm kind of looking for that deep setup, so that's why I picked the S type instead of the attack setup. Let's do a little pull for you guys. Kind of suck over here by my work, but let's see what we can do. We got a little tunnel up here too. for this video though please hit that subscribe button below hit that like button and comment below if you guys like the video if you guys like the exhaust i'll see you guys next time